Good afternoon everyone and welcome back to the skit session where we are going to talk about software quality industry trends. This is me Herschel, a software product specialist at Qmetry and we are going to continue talking on shift left continuous quality through BDD and Insprint Automation and today we are going to talk about Insprint Automation. Alright, so when we are talking about Insprint Automation, what is Insprint Automation? When we are talking about agile testing and talking about shift left testing, the instant automation is very important, right? And in shift left, you're talking about in sprint. So what you see here is a traditional sprint uh, in our agile testing methodology. And when we are talking about shift left, you're talking about in sprint automation or in sprint testing. So uh, for, at the beginning of the sprint, in both the traditional as well as in sprint, we have the sprint planning phase. Once the sprint planning is done, in our traditional sprint, we have our sprint, say if it's a two week sprint, then it's a staggered approach where our development team starts working in week one and say maybe towards the later part of the week one, my QA team will start working on um, the QA activities. Whereas when we talk about in sprint testing, as soon as the planning phase is done or even during the planning phase sometimes, you involve the QA or quality engineering team, which can uh, give you insightful data points uh, right from the uh, planning phase of the sprint itself. And once the planning is done, say again, we have two week sprints. Here you can see we are not only doing the development activities, but my quality engineering team, which uh, includes my manual testing team as well as my automation team, working on my uh, QA activities right from or testing activities right from the day one of the sprint rather than in the staggered approach or the traditional sprint approach where we have our QA sprint being staggered with the development sprint by one week. Now what is the advantage of that right when we are talking about shift left if you remember from the previous video we want to test often and test early and this is what we are trying to get to through in sprint or testing or in sprint automation. 